Hello, all of my sleepy bears. My name's Chronicle Blue. Welcome back to some more Dark Cloud. I went ahead and I just did a quick little glance around the map in order to see if there was any treasure chests. We got some scorpion jerky. That's pretty good. Well, I'm assuming it's good. I really don't know, actually. Making us walk all the way over here. Sweet goodness. A grass cake. That'll be really helpful. Okay, and I want to say that's all of it, actually. Yep. All right, cool. So we're going to go ahead and add those items to our people. We know Tabby likes Scorpion Jerky. Man, he's got really good defense. The grass cake is for Garfield. Which is good, because I was... I want to say just last episode I was complaining about how we don't have enough defense for them. But, we do have the Sun Sinye and the Moon Sinye. So, I believe we know what to do. Let's go on over to the Sun and Moon Temple. Do this. What I believe to be the final area for the Sun and Moon Temple, I should state. Hey, look at that. <laughs> and, of course, I did not look up how to do the spots beforehand. So, there might be a little bit of fumbling, and then finding out what to do afterwards. Alright, so we're going to put the red one here. And the blue one right here. We still have some of those items that I don't know what they're for. That's a giant eye. If it doesn't move and I just have to shoot it, I'd be very happy. This is some intense music. I like it. Whoever disturbs my sleep shall be punished by death. Ah, we're doing that thing. Okay, okay. King's Curse. Blue, the ancient king's spirit is possessed by the dark genie as well. Can you defeat him? I don't really have a choice. Alright, so we're gonna run away. We're gonna go ahead and swap to the cat, because she has really good attack. Now, I'm assuming the King's Curse means that uh, it needs holy. That's what I'm going to assume, anyway. Do we have holy? Yes, we do. Look at that. Okay, no effect. Awesome. So that means that we probably have to use something else on it. I want to say maybe Calico? Okay, that has fire on it. And holy, so that's good. No effect. Okay. Oh, I know what we have to do. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. I guess we just have to use Tabby a lot. Which, I mean, it's not bad. Like, it's fine, I guess. Ah, uh, of course it broke. Well, that's fine. So it's not bad damage. I thought this would be a little bit more challenging, but I guess not, so. I mean, I'm not upset. I'm just like, really? Like, you know what I mean? It's like, a lot of the people that we've been fighting, they've had like really long drawn out boss battles, but if this is 
just that, then I'm like, okay, I guess. And then I think he's, oh yeah, he's thirsty. Granted, we might just put a bomb here just to see if that will speed things up a little bit. Ow. It did not speed things up. I mean, it kind of did. You know, it made us take damage. I don't know. I just kind of thought it would be a little bit more difficult. But I guess the difficult part is just surviving, I guess. That and the fact that, you know, doing the wind move takes a lot of weapon hit points, which is not fantastic. Let's put that on there. Because that might help. No effect. Cool. I mean, it's worth a shot. Like, yeah, in theory, we could just keep doing this. I think the music is way too cool for it to be used here. Like, I imagine, like, a, a Benny Hill song. Yeah, I believe that's it, you know. The song they play when people are running through doors and such. I don't know, it just... It just doesn't feel... Like, boss battle material. You know what I mean? Like, maybe a mini-boss. It just... It doesn't feel like it should be a boss-boss. But, hey. I'm glad I didn't have to figure out... <laughs> I'm glad I did not have to look up how to attack the boss. Because that's... That's been annoying. So... I definitely take something easy. But since we're going to be here for a while, I can talk about my Xbox. So, what's been going on is that with the Xbox... Ow. Okay. Tagging me like that. It's not nice. It's a good thing I have chicken. And I probably won't be able to attack you. I mean, that works. Anyway, with my Xbox, what's been going on is that I I have two Xbox 360s. I have one that is good. It's fine. You can see the fan because they cut a hole in it for some reason. But it, it, it works. The other one also works. But, and here's the funny thing, the disk drive works. So for the one that has the hole cut in it so you can see the fan, the disk drive does not work. So I've been using it as like a Xbox 360 digital. And I've been buying most of the games off of the store in order to be able to, you know, play them for fun. Okay, I wasn't going to change my weapon, like. But he looks like he might die. I'm not even sure I'm a more... Not too much more we can take of this, so cool, I guess. We don't need to do anything here, actually. I guess I'll do the mellow banana. And regular water. So, what I did was, I want to try to transfer the information from the Xbox 360 bad to the Xbox 360 good. The Xbox 360 good is the, like, original original. Like, you have to buy an adapter for it to connect to the internet. 
Oh, that's new. Maybe that means that we're getting close to finishing. Thank you. If you could let me run away, that'd be great. Ah, okay, you're back to normal now. Awesome. So, I bought a USB cable for data transferring, so I'll be able to transfer it over and make it think, oh, this is just a storage device. Let's transfer everything. No, 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 no. That, that will not work. That was way too simple. So what I had to do was I had a USB micro, thankfully, lying around, and an adapter through USB. So I plugged that into the Xbox 360 bad, transferred all the information, and then transferred all of it into the Xbox 360 good. So that's fun. That 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 took a while. In fact, I even made some videos about it on my TikTok page. Which, I don't know if you knew I had a TikTok page, but yeah, I have a TikTok page. I just post dumb things and behind the scenes content. You know, nothing riveting. You're not gonna lose a bone or anything. My goodness, this man's taking forever. And like, actually, that's a question. Hey, there we go. <laughs> Ooh. A boat? Kind of looks like a boat. What a beautiful ship! I said ship. Moon people are all born artists. This ship is a testament to that. Oh! Oh no! Now that the king's curse has been broken, something is happening to the temple! Blue, get on the moon ship! That away! Man, I'm getting too old for this. Oh, that's not good. What the heck? Clea. I kind of wish that wasn't a quick time event, because I feel like I could have had a lot more fun with that, but eh, whatever. What is it? What's going on? I have no idea. What's that? Is it gonna fly in front of the moon like E.T.? By the way, E.T. is such a weird movie. Like, I'm not sure why people like it. it it's it's unique. That that's for sure. Come on, let's move it. 
Here we go. To the ocean of stars and beyond. <laughs> to yellow drops. It's flying. You're right. That kid must be on it. That kid? Yeah, the one with the green hat and those beautiful eyes. There's something special about him. Yep, they pulled an ET. Tabby, blow, good luck. What? I did not know they were rabbits. Okay then. Is that where they got the idea for rabbits on Super Mario Galaxy? I think so. Also, how are we gonna breathe on the moon? Say, you don't stare about like that. People will think we're Hicks. Hicks is a slightly derogatory term for Southerners. Which, it's okay. I, I am Southern, so. Florida. Got the heat waves to prove it. Welcome to Yellow Drop. I have heard the story from them of... Brown Boo. These days we have this neat communication system called Crystal Net. We get information fast. Unfortunately, the mayor is not here right now, but rest assured, I, Samba, will serve as your guide in place of the mayor. Please come this way. Uh, thanks, I guess. Do you have a shop so I can buy more things or. Alright then. I'm gonna get lost here. I have a feeling this is the place where we do not build things, so there's no fast travel. Come on, Blue, I will give you a tour around the village. Where shall we start? Excuse me. Yes, it's me. Oh, Linda, what's up? Eh? Our date today? Yikes! Come on, I didn't forget. How could I forget that? No way, really? Yeah, sure, gotcha. I'm leaving right now. Be there in a flash. Wow, I'm so sorry, Blue. I have an emergency. I have to go right away or I'll be in the deep. Bye. All right, then. Okay, so we are here. Wherever here is. And no, fast travel is off. Dang it. Hi, my name is Mania. Collector of rare moon items. I collect old items. Do you have any for me? Old moon items. Um. Cool. Uh, I. I have a lollipop. If that helps. Like that's the only other. Okay. Cool. Um. Hey, door. <laughs> this is the factory that our boss is so proud of. What do you think? It's something, isn't it? I'm let on. I am in charge of this factory. I was told about you. Nice to meet you. Oh, Samba is supposed to be your guide. He's not around. Well then. 
I will take his place and guide you. So I hear you need to know about the sealing technique. That is a secret skill from ancient times used by our ancestors. Maybe our boss knows. Shall we go? This is the great factory our boss, leader of the moon people, has created. There is nothing you can't make here. Unfortunately, the boss is not here. Along with testing the new model, he has entered a contest. If it's urgent to see him now, go to the Colosseum. The Colosseum is straight ahead past the Moon Sea. However, the Moon Sea has changed recently. Monsters are lurking all over now. Also, the structure of the Moon Sea seems to have become more complicated. I'll walk you to the entrance of the Moon Sea. This way, please. What exactly is the Moon Sea? Beyond this gate is the Moon Sea. But then, it's quite different from any sea you know. Recently, many monsters started appearing in the Moon Sea. Stay sharp and be careful. Various recovery and support items are sold in this village. Be fully prepared before you set foot on the Moon Sea. So long now. Yeah, uh, thanks, I guess. Okay, well, before we... Hello. You need gunpowder to use that cannon that transports you around the moon sea craters. There's sure to be somewhere in each crater. Maybe one of the monsters has it. Uh, thank you. Apparently we need gunpowder. What do you have? You're from Blue Terra? What are you doing here? Got nothing better to do. Apparently not. If I had something better to do, then I wouldn't be here. Is that... Okay, so that's where we entered. There's a factory. Um... Hi, my name is Mania. Collector of rare moon items. Yeah, I know you. Did we really talk to this one all the way over here? I think so. Have you met before? Couldn't have, I guess. Thanks, you're helpful. Man, there's so many, like, winding paths. Okay, this has to be something helpful. What the? I can't believe that time I got a girlfriend before me. That, that's nice, dear. No way to climb up. No way to climb up. There's no way to climb up. Hey, you're not from around here, are you, weirdo? Well, I'm glad we're nice people. Yeah, that's, that's just such a weird sound. I can't imagine hearing that on your PS2 and thinking that something's dying. You're like, no, no, I'm so close, please. Ceiling skill, I never heard of it. What is it? Well, that's what I'm trying to figure out. Is this a helpful resource? Hi, in Yellow Drops, we've kept a particular tradition for ages, but the boss completely disregarded it into building a high-tech factory. I wonder if it was the right thing to do. Do you really have to get rid of the old to create something new? Thank you, I guess. No way to climb up. Have you seen that bravery launch? It's a cursed boar that makes you want to jump off when you step on it. I'm not that stupid. I'd not be good on it. Thanks, I guess. So in other words, no, you're not helpful. I'm not looking for the world here. I'm really not. I just want to buy things. Why there's so many doors to the factory, I'll never know. And that's where we were. That's to there. So... That means that this has to be something new. Hi there, who are you? I'm Jive. 
I know all about weapons, so listen up. To build up a Sun Sword, increase its original anti-bases evenly. And then all five elemental attributes up to the necessary level. Thanks, I guess. Oh, thank you, finally. Wow. Gun made of shell fires magic bolts, and then we got an upgraded machine gun. My goodness. Okay, well, that's that's something, I guess. So, lo and behold, we're going to get someone that uses guns. So, that's cool. Okay. Double omelet. Expensive gold omelet. Okay, so. Better axe. Steve does not do anything, actually. He, he, he talks. So. And we have all these weapons. Okay, so we're going to keep the Sun Sword. I will sell that. I'll sell that. Okay, so we can get quite a bit for that. Because I really want that Jackal. But. I'm going to need some of these. And we're good on everything else. Hey. All right. Okay, cool. I feel like I made a very good investment. And if I didn't, too bad. Um, probably gonna need this stuff. Standing powder, rival, fix stuff. As opposed to break stuff. Uh, let's get some more water. Yeah, like that. Like that. That feels like a good amount of water. All right, good. So this is some kind of like factory slash rabbit area. Okay. Not sure I understand, but you know, I'll I'll go with it. You know, be Gucci. I'm pretty sure you've been there. I, I just wish there were signs. Like I'm not, I'm not. I don't think I'm asking the world here. Just, just signs, like a weapon or a potion, something to help me figure out where I am. But granted, out of all the times that we've been to different villages, this is the first time I've gotten confused. So maybe that's a good sign. The fact that I get confused so late in the game. Nope, that can't be it. Oh, well, I can't just leave you right here. We gotta go and see what's inside to see the wonderful animation. As well as I need to get some water and coffee because my throat hurts. This is beautiful. Look at this. Do you see how beautiful this is? I mean, I know you do. But at the same time, like it, it just looks so fantastic. <laughs> They just fire us in the cannon. My goodness. I've never had difficulty deciding on what thumbnail to choose for a video. I always just go to like a random part and was like, yeah, that's that's fine. Here, I'm like, man, there's like five different ones I could do. But now's a good time to stop. So, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. I will see you all next time. Goodbye, my CB Bears. 